Good morning! Welcome back to my channel, The Diaries of DIY Danny. I, of course, am Danny, and my throat is going. <coughs> It is a morning in Florida. I am not in my little house. Oh, you can see palm trees, that's so fun. So this is a little bit of a different kind of video. So I am here visiting my dad for a week and my friend Alexandra decided she would like to join to get away from the cold. So we've been having an awesome week here. I also went to Disney for two days, which if you head over to my Instagram, you can check out that entire journey. I was like pretty much on cloud nine. I like cried every second I was in that park seeing the Star Wars I totally recommend doing it if you haven't gone yet and you love Star Wars like do it so 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 worth it um, but while we were here Alexandra and I were like we got to go to Target it's our favorite place on the planet um, it's just I know a lot of you are from the, who live in the US are like I don't get it but like we don't have Target in Canada and it's just it's got the best stuff and that's such a good price and we're just we just we get giddy so while we are here there's a super Target down the street and we are for it so we are going to travel to Target today and we're going to be doing an entire haul Alexandra is going to be doing her haul on her channel I'm going to be doing my haul on my channel and I hope you guys love what we found we're about to leave in like 10 minutes I'm just going to go put some lipstick on because you know and then we're gonna get going so stay tuned we're about to journey to Target and it's gonna be a blast are you ready so ready <laughs> everything is one dollar how terrible are these oh my god DIY overalls cute I'll take you Oh, that is so you. Oh my God. Yes. <gasps> Boyfriend jeans. <gasps> A sweatshirt onesie. Okay, I kind of really like this hat. Where, where are you going? If there's a moment to feel bougie, this is it. I'm not going to buy it. But I love it. We're heading into the home section and I'm like shaking. Oh, I want these in my little art room. Oh my God, all this bedding is so beautiful. Look at you, beautiful. It's only $25. What does it smell like? Fresh. <laughs> fresh, just fresh. Thanks, Joanna. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, I love it. it's made of wood. Oh, and this one's made of wood too. That's so cool. Oh my gosh. I love this. Do you guys think I should hack this? Woo, terrazzo. That's so fun. You should buy that. I'm really big fan of this. How do I get this home on the plane? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, but this one. So many baskets. So many possibilities. So many possibilities. <laughs> Bye baskets. I'm sorry I can't take you home with me. Danny, you're having a bit of a freak out. This is what I've been looking for. Like this. The one dollar. <laughs> she's like, I'm speechless. I'm like, okay. Let's just... <laughs> I'm like, Run, start heart. the car. I'm having a heart attack. I'm like, is this for real? <laughs> this is a haul, but we fit it all in one car. Yeah, we just have to get this back on the. Yeah, this is all somehow coming back to Toronto with us. Whoops. Okay, so we are back from Target. We're in a very comfortable environment. Palm tree. Sunny Florida. Florida. It was freezing this morning, but now it's quite warm, which is nice. Yeah, we were gonna do this haul when we got back yesterday, but it was like 5.36. It's like 5 p.m. Yeah. And we left at 10 or 11? We got there at 11. <laughs> we left, we got there at 11 and we left at like five. No words. 
No worries. We took a lunch break for a half an hour. I'm like, why am I so exhausted today? <laughs> Probably because we were walking <laughs> Target for eight hours. <laughs> Where do we Let's want to start? This. Oh my gosh, I don't know. Why is my throat going? <laughs> like, who am I? Okay, I'm gonna start with these. So, as you guys know, in my videos, I always wear a lot of um, hats. It's like a thing. I, I, to be honest, the reason why I wear hats 98.5% of the time is because I haven't showered that day and I just really need to cover my hair. Relatable. Yeah, so I ended up buying two new hats. I, oh my God, it like actually almost matches your shirt. I think this is a really trendy color. This. this like terracotta burnt orange color. This is gonna be not functional going into the summer, but right now, cause it's still winter in Canada. This is like very misleading for me. I'm like, yeah, I bought this hat and it's so sunny and hot. I'm like sweating. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not even like putting this on. I'm wearing a tube. <laughs> yeah. I'll still do it. Um, so I got burnt orange because that's a color that um, I just really like. And I'm like for the trend it's right everywhere now. Everywhere right now. And I love it. But then I, oh, I, I love this. I broke outside my comfort zone. Pink is not something I naturally gravitate to, but like how fun is that? It's like neon pink. But I think I want to find like a lipstick to match it. You're just like so fun with your fashion. <laughs> Thank you. And quirky. Thank you. Um, that's so nice. Fine. Okay, so the next item like I'm going this. to talk about is um, this is part of the Opal House. This is a handcrafted woven vase, but so much. I'm gonna go hack that um, because I was thinking if I took out the bottom of this, this would make the cutest like hanging pendant light. I love it. Such a good idea. You could put a light bulb inside and then find like the cord. I have so many pendant light cords at home that I'm like, this is perfect. I'll just take it at the bottom and hack it. Where are you gonna put it? Oh, I don't know. Maybe in my new office that you make over. Video coming soon. Well, I was actually thinking, yeah, like over the, Wouldn't that be the nice? table. Yeah. It's a cute vase. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm like, it's a cuter pendant light. Okay, Ooh. moving on. So one thing every time I go to Target, I don't know what you like get the down low. Um, I, I'm a hand talker, I'm just smashing the face. I'm not used to having Wait, two people on screen. <laughs> Bam. That's not the worst. You can do it from the pool. You're like little mermaid. mermaid. <laughs> you can do it like from over there. On the, on the like, You can be over there. <laughs> Anyways, um, one thing that I always get when I go to Target um, are white, plain white sneakers. They really are- I'm regretting not getting these. Yeah, you should. I know. You should regret it. I do. Um, these are $14.99 and like, I don't know why, but they are the comfiest shoes I have ever owned. But then you ask the question, you're like, why do you get white shoes when you're DIYing? They'll get dirty. And I'm like, exactly. Is that like a creative thing? <laughs> no, but like, I love when I'm painting. I like seeing paint splatters on my shoes. Yeah. I like seeing dirt. I don't know. It's just, it's something that I love in the DIY space. I love like seeing the projects that are built up on something. Like I have paint pants and I love, I always like yeah. purposely wipe my hands on them because I like that look. I don't know. It's really beautiful. Hey, it's like artistic. It's like so beautifully artistic. No, but yeah. I, I totally get it. I always buy, I actually normally buy like two versions, but I bought so much. So I'm like, maybe I'll get one this time. <laughs> <laughs> I get a few extra baskets. Yeah. <laughs> so I bought one pair, but I'm really excited about this. I yeah. know, I'm kind of thinking maybe I should go back and get some. Cause yeah, they're just like such great summer shoes. They are. Excellent summer shoes. Yeah. They're so comfortable. I'm like, yes. Yeah. Walk a mile in my and shoes. And white running shoes look good with anything. everything. Dresses, skirts, jeans, sports shorts, Sh pants, workout gear. <laughs> Do you know what that is? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what? That was good. That was clever. <laughs> that was really clever. I know. Um, okay, what, do, what should I do next? Do this. Okay. This was such a good find. This is something I am very passionate about. While I don't actually talk about it in my videos like ever, um, if you ever see me in my living room, this is always running. Yeah. But we found one that's in a ter looks like a terracotta it's pot. So beautiful. And it's stunning. No, I, I just love, love this. And it's simple. It comes with the plug in. Love it. Um, but with that, um, there's one. Uh, essential oil that I always, always have in the house. And mostly because I have a dog, there are certain natural essential oils that you shouldn't um, blast, diffuse, diffuse um, around them because it, it, it's harmful for their nose. Um, so I always do the orange and lemongrass. Um, it's like really soft. It doesn't like burn your senses. Like the eucalyptus one, you're like, woo! Yeah. 
I like the orange. It's not invasive, but it smells so fresh. Like there's nothing better than walking in, yeah, in your house and like this like fresh smell of oranges. Yes. It's like, it's the best. I'm obsessed with it. I find it very calming to me. I do um, the Relax by Sage. Yes. I'm in the bedroom. So good. Because it's like a place, serene place, but this one I love. I can already smell it. Yeah, it's good. Ooh. Let me, give me a, give me a. Yeah. Smell that? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's a happy um, blend essential oil. Muji sells this, but this one, I've never bought the Target one, so I don't know if it, I hope it smells the same. Oh my. Oh, yeah, it's lovely. That's exactly what it's just like. It's like fresh. Yeah, it just smells Ooh. fresh. Okay, now I need to go back and get some of this too. <laughs> good, good find. Okay. Um, let's talk about, yeah. Oh, should we talk about Brenda? Yeah. Brenda! Look at Brenda. Okay, um, so, wait, can, I, I mean, I don't know. If it, can yeah. we just show, I'll yeah. show mine on your channel too. Because the, this, there's a story to this. They, they, they come in a set. Like, and what did we call, this we is called Brenda. her Delilah. Oh yeah, Brenda and Delilah. Like, we first saw them, I'm like, oh my God, it's Brenda. <laughs> and then you're like, and it's Delilah. I, was like, I just okay. named them off the top. Um, this and we, is also Opal House. Yeah, I love it. I just, I mean, it has a hole in the bottom stop. to drain. Oh yeah, it does. Actually, yeah, you should see this. So it has a little hole in the bottom, yeah. a little sticky tab. Sorry if that's out of focus. Um, I'm a sucker for a cute plant pot. Same. And also, you could use this for anything. You can use it for jewelry, yeah. or like makeup brushes even, paint or brushes. pencils, or paint brushes. Yeah, I just I just love her. I love them both. They're besties. Yeah. Um, so I picked this up. This has nothing to do with DIY, <laughs> but I just picked it up, so I'm gonna show you guys anyways. This is a tea tree and spearmint room spray. Um, I bought this because I like any room that I'm like in, if I'm doing art, like painting or something, I'm like a total like scene setter, if yeah. that makes sense. Yeah. Like, I like burn a candle, I have a diffuser. Yes. I'm like, my whole room is like a meditation. Love that. And then I start painting, I'm like listening to Lord of the Rings soundtrack or something. Whatever. Something nerdy. Um, so yeah, I I found this and I sprayed it and it was very potent. Like I think I smelled like this the rest of the day, which I'm not complaining about, but I just thought this is a really great solution um, when if you don't have a diffuser. But yeah. I'm like, oh, I will travel with this everywhere I go. Or in the bathroom. Oh yeah. It's, it's tea like tree poopery. Experiment. <laughs> exactly. It's so it good. So like fresh. Yeah. I love anything peppermint. Like I love ice cream peppermint. I love yes. peppermint face masks, peppermint hand sanitizers, anything. Any so good. I love peppermint gum. Let me spray. No, on your face though. It just <laughs> <laughs> Another decor thing I picked up. Oh, this is Opal House again. I think I, I think I was right. I definitely attracted the Opal House. Now you saw this and you're like, oh my god, I want it. But you're like, I have too many, and I'm like, okay. <laughs> But I love this. And you made a good point. I was like, do I, so this is, well, this is like a, a tea towel or a bathroom towel. I'm like, do I need this? I was like, do I need to buy this? And then you said, well, it's really hard to find nice, like hand towels. It is. And I was like, that's so true. That are like decorative. Yeah, like I, I mean, I'm sure you can like, maybe go online, but like just walking into a store, it's yeah. hot. You're right, it's hard. And like, look how cute this is. It's got so little cute. tassels and so it's cute. got like just these nice little like minimal looking um, markings all around it. Um, I just thought it was the most darling thing in the world. They also have bigger bath towels too. Yeah, I didn't think a hand towel would make me so happy, but like- Welcome to my life. <laughs> makes me so happy. So, decorative hooks. Um, let me talk about these. I'm a big terrazzo. <laughs> I have to say, you that are actually um, fan, and I'm mostly because I think I'm obsessed with the idea of DIYing it. Like I want to like nail down the craft of doing terrazzo. These are just so beautiful. I feel like I should just take them out because I'm gonna end up. What are you gonna use them for? Do you think? So I am. Um, I'm gonna be doing a front entryway makeover soon. Yeah. They have the terrazzo front, but what I really like is on the back. Um, they're so they're just easy. They're just hooks. Yeah, like regular old hooks. They're really cute. So easy install. Love it. Just gotta put. They're a screw. also nice and like big. Yeah, but they're not heavy. Like feel chunky. that. Yeah, they're really. Lovely. Yeah, like I like that they're heavy and chunky. I also really like that they're gonna be small for the suitcase. <laughs> yes. Take them out the Smart box. Buy. Truck them in there. Exactly. Another thing I found, um, which okay, I love this so much. So, I okay. One thing you guys should know about me is that I have a sick obsession with books, like notebooks. 
Um, like I'll just buy notebooks. It took me, it took like <laughs> everything in me not to buy a new agenda at Target when okay. I have, like I just spent like a lot of money on a good agenda, right? But like, I'm talking like I buy sketchbooks after sketchbook after sketchbook. Um, and I just literally bought a new sketchbook. But anyways, here we are. But like, okay, I have to say like, this is such a it's nice, so beautiful, nice. it's like dark, uh, it's soft, sorry is what I meant to say. It's soft, I don't know, I just thought it was really unique. Um, and I just like the way that it feels. I love this kind of paper. It's great. And I like that it like falls flat. What do they call this? Open bound, high quality paper, 240 pages. It's great. I saw it, I'm like, I have to buy this. I even think like for bullet journaling, you could use that. Oh yeah, you were saying you want to get into that. Well, I want to get into a lot of things. <laughs> True. <laughs> Actually, I do want to get into journaling. Oh, which I right. also Sorry, think this would be good said. for. Like yes. to, to write a thought a day and to be able to draw. Yeah, hundred percent. Really cool. So my biggest target find, which I've left to last, um, is all about organization. This was the like one thing that I think I was like the most excited yeah. about when we were in Target. Like I literally like you, had like, a heart attack. Freaked out. We got it on camera. It was hilarious. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna leave you with your bin. They're like plastic frosted uh, organization bins. I should keep in mind that I'm showing you guys the one version of each. This is this isn't even like to, there like was I a think lot. I bought like three of everything. There was a lot. So then there was also like a little tray. This is so good when you're crafting and you have like little dainty pieces. So you, like you can put this on the table and then put all your little crafty bits in there. I also think for jewelry and stuff too. Yes, if you're in like a bathroom. if like a beauty guru, whatever, like you, it's this is great anywhere. Yeah. Um, and then they had the small ones. This is so good for organizing brushes, pencils, paint brushes, like everything. So I bought a bunch of these because it's just so handy. Um, and then like, yeah, so then they had like smaller bin, they had this bin, um, and then they had this one here, I love this one. which has a lid on it, which I guess they call, what do they call this? A file crate. I mean, yeah, they say it's for filing. I wouldn't file anything. I would probably just put like, like crafty stuff in it. Um, but the reason why I'm so obsessed with these is I, I brought this up before, but, um, Muji, I'm like obsessed with Muji. Like I go into Muji just to, like for the environment. I, when Alexandra and I were talking about my office makeover, I told her, I'm like, I want to feel like I'm walking into Muji. Yes. yes. <laughs> so if you're ready for a Muji art room makeover, be prepared. Also let us know in the comments down below, um, what you want to see for Danny's office makeover yeah. is there something you want me to focus on in particular like organizing yeah. um art room makeover not office sorry art it's like my office your office but... your art room makeover yeah. um what kind of colors do you want to see i mean you have a pretty clear vision but i'd love to know from danny's followers what you guys want to see in the video thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this shop along follow along docu follow vlog whatever this <laughs> was this was like a lot of everything it was a lot of everything, Don't but catch. let me know if you want to see more <laughs> like this because I definitely, um, I love shopping. So <laughs> and I'm happy to share. I love shopping, period. Yeah, just period. <laughs> um, but I love shopping for DIY stuff and cool finds and cool stuff. So anyways, if you want me to share more of this in the future, let me know in the comment section below and head over to Alexandra's because she's got cool decor stuff that she's about to share for her channel. Ooh. I will link it down below. So uh, thanks. Okay, bye-bye.